Hi, it's Todd. Welcome to day nine of the escalation phase of the fitness camp. Today's warm up is an ascension warm up. We're going to start with five seconds on and 25 seconds off, then 10 seconds on and 20 seconds off, 15, 15, and finally the last round will be 20 seconds on and 10 seconds off. And the exercises are as follows We're going to begin with squats, then the low plank ab squeeze, then max jumps and finally push-ups plus. I'll explain the exercises in the first round, so let's get to it. All right, here we go with the ascension warm-up. First round is five seconds on, 25 seconds off. We're gonna begin with squats in 10 seconds. Remember, keep your weight back. Your toes are pointed out in the direction that your upper thighs are so that your legs are completely in line. Keep your head and chest up. Two, one, go. Done, all right, great first round, huh? Okay, we've got 25 seconds until low plank ab squeeze. You're gonna be in the low plank position, which is forearms in the ground, elbows directly beneath your shoulder, and you're just gonna squeeze your abs and release. Squeeze, relax. Starting in five seconds. Two, one, go. Squeeze, relax. Squeeze, relax. Done, nice job. On your feet, max jumps are next. Gonna have your feet about shoulder width apart. Gonna take a quick dip, arms go back, and then you're gonna jump as high as you can. Reach for the sky. The idea is uh, somewhat like you're blocking a shot in volleyball or you're trying to rebound in basketball. Two, one, go. Done, nice job. Last one is push-ups plus. We're gonna do a push-up, regular push-up, and then at the end of the push-up, you're gonna extend your shoulder blades. It's a two-part motion. The extension, of course, is the plus part. Starting in six seconds. Three, two, one, go. Push-up, plus, push-up, Plus, done, nice job. Back to the beginning, squats. This round is 10 seconds on, 20 seconds off. About six seconds left till we start again. Three, two, one, go. Remember, have your toes pointed out at the angle your legs are at. Head and chest up, weight on your heels. Done, nice job. Next up is low plank ab squeeze. About 10 seconds toward beginning. Five seconds. Three, two, one, go. Squeeze, relax. Gotta really concentrate on this. Try to squeeze your entire abdominals. Done. Nice job. Max jumps are next. Max jumps. Quick dip. Jump as high as you can. Seven seconds for starting. Three, two, one, go. Done, nice job. Push-ups plus. Last exercise of round two. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, push-ups plus. Done, nice job. Back to the beginning, 15 seconds on, 15 seconds off for this round. Squats are first. Three, two, one, squats. Good job, good job, keep it up. Weight back. Done, nice job. Low plank ab squeeze. In 
Seven seconds. Two, one, go. Squeeze, relax. Sometimes it helps to exhale on the squeeze. Done. Max jumps. Five seconds. Here we go. Two, one, max jumps. Jump as high as you can. Done. Nice job. Push ups plus is next. Ten seconds. Two, one, push up plus. Done. Squats are next. Twenty seconds on, ten seconds off. Two, one, go. Every once in a while, check down at your feet. Make sure they're pointed at the proper angle. Which is in line with your thighs. Done, nice job. Low plank ab squeeze. Three, two, one, go. Done. Max jump. Three, two, one, go. Swing your arms back. Jump as high as you can. It's a quick jump. Actually, a quick dip and jump. That's what I meant to say. Done. Push ups plus. Three, two, one, go. Done. All right, grab a quick break, get back here. We'll start Escalation Day 9 workout. Welcome back. Hope you had a chance to grab a drink and catch your breath. Let's talk about today's workout. Today we're performing three, four, or five rounds of the following. 10 push-ups, 10 froggers, and 10 bicycle abs. Now you'll choose between three, four, or five rounds based on your current conditioning level and your personal eagerness today. I'll be demonstrating all five rounds in a medium fast pace. All you need is a mat and some water, so let's get to it. All right, here we go. Push-ups are regular push-ups, froggers. If you remember, you have your, keep your back strong the entire time, meaning torso pretty much straight up and down, head and chest up. You're gonna squat down hopefully far enough to touch your fingers without bending over, without hunching forward. And then you're gonna drive yourself up into the air, keeping your arms down here. Sometimes, if you want to, you can reach up above your head. It's completely up to you. It doesn't have, happen to be my personal style, but I see many people doing it that way. So you're down here, up, that's a frogger. And then bicycle abs. We know what bicycle abs are, but let's talk about how to do them specifically. You make sure one, point, one foot is pointed out completely, and when the other one comes in, try to touch your elbow, 
I mean your knee with your opposite elbow have my physiology my anatomy there uh, messed up and make sure you keep your shoulder blades off the ground so you should feel your abdominals tight the entire time as I mentioned in the preview three four five rounds quickly as you can I'll be maintaining a medium fast pace so here we go beginning with push-ups push-ups froggers bicycle abs three two one go you decide how many rounds you're gonna do based on where you are right now and your personal motivation today but always try to push yourself just live to fight another day. Oh, on the bicycle abs, every right left is one. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So both sides equals one rep. If you already had done your bicycle abs and counted them another way, well, I guess you get a free pass on that one today. If you're exactly with me, you're starting the second round. Remember on push-ups, your hips, stomach, chest should touch about the same time. If you're going to error one way or another, try to make it your chest. That'll uh, allow you to get the full range of motion that you're going for. Head and chest up on the froggers. Don't hunch forward. Exactly with me. You're done with two rounds. Be sure keep yourself hydrated at all times. If you're with me, we're starting round three. If you can go faster. Go faster. With me, you're finished with three rounds. Keep going, keep going, push yourself. If you're with me, and you're going all five, you got one left. Now remember, you can stop at three, four, or five rounds, so long as you push yourself a little bit. If 
We're maintaining my pace. We're starting round five. Here we go. On to the froggers. All right, if you're with me, you're done. If you're a little behind, quick as you can, finish up. If you've been done for a bit, awesome. But anyway, no matter where you are at this moment, be sure you get plenty of drink as far as water is concerned. Eat right today and get your sleep. I'll see you next time.